Members of a Dane County family can't sleep in their house tonight because it's not there anymore. It burned down in a fire this morning. It started around 7 in a home on County Highway A in Albion. That's between Stoughton and Edgerton. Pictures from the scene show flames just took over the house. A father and son were inside and got out safely. New at 10, Grace Alch has you covered on the firefighting efforts and the neighbor who pulled over when he saw the home was on fire. It was coming through this morning uh, about five, ten minutes before seven o'clock. Doug Like takes County Road A in Albion to get to work every morning. Monday morning, he was following the same route as he always does. I was coming around the corner, saw like some smoke and flames, and I didn't realize it was a house until I got closer. Came up, I didn't see fire trucks or anything yet, so I pulled over. Like says that's when he saw a father and son standing in the front yard. Both were still in their pajamas. Like got a coat and boots from his car to help them keep warm. Like says the two hadn't called 911 yet, so Like dialed for them. When we pulled up, literally there were there was fire coming out of every window on every side of the house, so it, it had quite a head start. Lakeside Fire Rescue Chief Randall Pickering says when their station got the call, the house and the shed were already in flames. Both of them managed to get out. They both had smoke inhalation um, and both had, um, and one gentleman had some, some scratches and things like that, but they were able to get out okay, which is the important thing. Chief Pickering says thanks to the partnerships Lakeside Fire and Rescue has made with surrounding departments, they feel confident that even as a rural department, they're going to be able to respond appropriately to any call. Our departments work so well together that it's, it's events like this, right, where you know we don't even have to think about it. We know our partners are coming and everybody goes to work. So In Albion, Gray Salch, 27 News. Both people in the home were taken to the hospital and treated for smoke inhalation. Chief Pickering says they're expected to be okay.